We're doing a lot of community engagement, looking at ways to look at how can we increase opportunities for residents with health and safety, weatherization, energy efficiency measures for their homes by getting offsets from the benefits that they will receive from the solar farms going into their communities. My name is Brianna Dubose. I'm the executive director of Legal Works. We provide energy efficiency, energy management, and community sustainability practices for communities. Eagle Works was one of the lead project partners um, with the Detroit Climate Strategy. And with that, we had the opportunity to work with community leaders to be able to look at guidelines and actions that would help create long-term strategies for health and safety, resiliency, energy efficiency, and reducing the energy burdens on communities of color. I'm Jabron Washington. I'm the program manager for the EcoD department at EcoWorks. It's that uh, filling out period where people are kind of trying to really get their grasp around what is this project. But once residents really got an understanding for the benefits, then discussions took off. The solar farms going in is a step forward in that, you know, even short to come, we like to see even community members and organizations like ourselves be able to like kind of participate. So many times uh, during these outages, it's the people that are paying more for the utility that are affected disproportionately when outages occur. And so they're losing medic medicine, they're losing food, they're without goods and services. So solar offers an option to be able to provide resilience. It provides an option to be able to provide outlets for community members to be able to be sufficient and sustained during outages while weathering these extreme climate impacts.